in China City, now like the Kashi Column Papi. Y'all know I'm extra, so I'm finna start with the lighter color. Then, so with this color right here, and then accentuate it a little bit with the darker one. Actually, nah, I'm just gonna mix both. I like to mix both, so I just. It's fucking Treyway! Hello, guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Manoa, if you've never seen me before. For those that are returning subscribers, what's up? What's good? Okay, go ahead and subscribe. Join the family now. Okay, 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 okay. Great. Today, you know what we're doing, okay? This is lesson four of my Eyeliner Makeup 101 series, and we're jumping straight into it. Eh, oh my god. This is so awaited for. Like, contouring. Everybody's like, I want to know how to contour. I want to know how to contour. Well, guess what? I'm bringing it to you today. Okay, anyways, guys, today I'll be showing you guys how to contour, and I'm going to be showing you guys how to contour with two uh, different type of products. I'm going to be showing you how to contour with a cream, contour, and powder. So I'm going to be doing one side of my face with the cream and another one with the powder. So let's go quickly over why we contour on a general basis. Contouring is just meant to define, sculpt, and enhance some parts of your face, you know. So for me, I just see it as shadowing, as you highlight certain parts of your face there are parts that you want to shadow not necessarily because you don't like it but just because you have other parts that you want to just that you want to bring forward okay so you're just shadowing some places that are not your most flattering parts for example or you just want a thinner face or you know for example if you feel like you have a big forehead like me like your Rihanna sister you feel me what's good you can go ahead and do a real like a real you know, enhance contour on your forehead. Or you feel like you have a double chin, you can definitely go ahead and contour that part. So I'll be showing you guys what parts of my face I contour, and that's what most, that's where most people contour. And then again, some people say you have to contour according to your face shape, but you know, the, the places where I'm gonna contour today is where most people do contour. So more than likely, it should apply to you. Today to contour, we are using these two products, my NICAC Duo Contour. It has these two uh, colors, a darker one and a lighter one, and it's only $1.99. Nah, y'all know I like a good deal. And then I'm gonna be using my Black Opal Foundation Stick as uh, one of the contours. I love this stick, it's about $8, I believe. Not the cheapest, but it's really dark. I took it in a really dark color. This is my contour. When I'm going out on a Saturday night, and I'm trying to slay, and nobody can talk to me, because I'm looking like Kim Kardashian, my face is thin, and you can't do nothing. You can't do nothing. So I'm gonna start with this side of my face, and I'm gonna be contouring it with my black opal foundation stick and then the other side like i said we're going to be doing it with um the powder so this is what it looks like oh <gasps> look what happened oh it got wasted mm, too bad so because this is very thick i like to take this side so i'll take it by the side and i'll just use this so this is what i'll be doing making a thin line okay and i like to contour here as well my forehead, where well, I'll be making, I like my my forehead contour to be really accentuated. So, yeah, that's what it's going to be looking like. And then we're not going to forget the nose. So for the nose, I like to grab a brush because it's delicate. So I'm grabbing this small brush right here and I'm just putting it into the product. And to contour my nose, to contour your nose, our nose, okay, you have to, I like to start here at my brow. So I'll just start right here. See that? Go down. So you're really just following the shape. So this is what it's supposed to look like. That's what the side of my face is contour. And we're gonna blend that in, you feel me? And two things that you can blend it with, you can blend it with your beauty blender or simply a brush. A smaller brush for this. Um, remember, you start blending, blending where your eyebrow starts. See that? The face, the side of her face that is not contoured, the side of her face that is contoured. 
and you just have to make sure everything is very well blended i like my nose to be very shadowed here as you can see so i just really want this part to be seen so guys we have contoured this side of our face with the cream uh, uh, with the cream foundation stick now we're going to do this side of our face with the powder and I know some of y'all gonna be loving that powder because it's only $1.99 and it gives you a great job as well. Okay, so this is what we're using. Again, I'm showing it to you because I'm bound. Okay, yeah. Y'all know I'm extra, so I'm finna. I'm finna start with the lighter color, then so with this color right here, and then accentuate it a little bit with the darker one. Actually, nah, I'm just gonna mix both. I like to mix both, so I just go back and forth, back, back and forth, back and forth. Blending here, as you can see. Bam. To our chin. Forehead. It, and I feel like it's way easier to control with the powder because it takes less time. It's just about targeting the areas where you want your contour. But then it's easy to also put too much when you're using the powder. I don't really want no fine. I don't really want so look at where we contoured our forehead temples the side of our cheeks our nose our chin so we can have a smaller face see now as you can already see the shape of my face that's going the my face is focused on this area right here and now we're going to do our nose as you guys already knew the nose is very delicate with the powder it's easier to go over the top so I'm using a small brush I'm trying to see Tina like Takashi Colum Poppy. I'm grabbing um, the lightest color here because I don't want I don't want to look like a squirrel. You feel me? Lightly. Following the same track, we're gonna bring it all the way up to our brow. People like the contour differently. My contour might be too much for you which I don't really think it is but some people might go for a really light contour they wouldn't accentuate their nose as much as me they just do light something light so it's just different I just want you guys to get the base of contouring so guys this concludes lesson four of my eyeliner makeup 11 series I hope you enjoyed this video you're well on your way to become a pro let me know what side you prefer the contour stick side or the powder side. I think I prefer the powder side. I mostly control with the powder because it's easier to blend and you don't have to go over again and whatever. I love you guys. See you guys next time. Let me know if you have any questions down below. Bye.